WTFNN. Headline news update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finish up 51, NASDAQ up 39, S&P's up three and a half. And when you take a look at this market, folks, I mean, you know, the bottom line, you get a sideways market. That being said, we've had a rock and rolling market out here today. I mean, this thing was uh, shaking, baking all over the place. We take a look at the uh, open out here with the, uh, with the open, you know, bottom line, the S&P's were down at this 31.98. You blast it up the first leg till 32.42. Come back down uh, into this uh, 32.12, then really took off like a rocket ship up to 32.68, and then just gave it up in spades, gave another 50 points up, came down once again into this 32.18, and finished out at 32.37. And Q's did the exact same thing, folks. So, bottom line, volatility, volatility's here and here big. Gold, gold contract rejected the lower price out here today. Had light of volume, you're up 520 in the gold contract, 1873. Silver also rejected it, up 14 cents, $23.24. Inside the GDX, as well as the uh, XAU, HUI, you're going to see the rejection. You had light of volume, bottom line, came back to the breakout area. It looks to me we'll get these uh, volumes uh, at 8 o'clock tonight. But what I expect you see here is that this is a classic, man. Uh, you go down hard and fast. You get down to the breakout area. We got below it. You rejected it. You go higher. Uh, and it's going to be really a trip coming into a Friday um, in the metals market when you had a tough metals week. Uh, bottom line, we'll see what this good old King Dollar is going to do because that is the number. When we take a look at King Dollar out here, what you had out here today is that you're down 41 ticks. But realistically, you know, you got to a higher high today. Uh, in three days, King Dollar went from this 92.749. Now, King Dollar can get up to 95.716. Um, if that's what we get, it's going to be trouble in paradise. If it gives it up, then guess what? That is saying uh, ASAP, you'll, you're going to see some movement once again inside, uh, which we got today, inside all, all of gold, those gold uh, equities. We're going to take a look at the small caps. Uh, the small caps out here, folks, bottom line. Uh, it's hard to comprehend right now, but the bottom line is that the small caps topped out in July of 2018. And yes, it is the 24th of September in 2020. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Come back and visit us tomorrow morning. Please tell your friends about TFNN. Tell them to go to YouTube. Subscribe. It is free. Have a great one, folks. Have a safe one. Thanks so much.